morning everybody <clears throat> welcome to another weekly vlog today is tuesday um yeah and i am now coming from the gym y'all if i give y'all a story let me start with it one time someone broke my car phone car phone holder that i just purchased well yes it's 40 dollars but <clears throat> So my dad was driving my car and because his own isn't starting and I think he had to drop my sister to work and one of them touched it. Okay, I do not care what they say. They said that it fell out just like that. Oh hell no, it can't fall out like that. Someone touched it because they probably don't know what it is. So it probably was playing fast and touching it and the entire thing broke out here. So I have to go and get our next one right now. Well, not right now, but a little later. As soon as I start to get a progression in this place, somebody broke my thing. Like, what the hell? Stop touching. Old thing does bring new things. They'll have to buy it back. And they'll have to buy two. Okay, so this entire piece here is missing. This is the piece that you don't have to hold the phone. So they probably was curious, like, what's this? What's this? And they touch it and they broke it. So don't come and tell me what shipping is about. It just broke. Like, dog, what? No. So, so old thing that's bring new thing and uh, see that. Hold on. <laughs> now I want back my car for older. So my father was like, um, you buy some some little cheap thing there and fall down. I don't want somebody break your thing. I was like, even if it's cheap, even though if it is cheap, it was working last time I left it because I vlogged here when I was gone from movie Friday night. I noticed this uh, Sunday morning. <clears throat> Okay, so leave me alone. So now I have to get another one. Hey y'all. So we are back at the beach. Well, we are on our way to Marcus, but we stopped at one of the lookout. And look how beautiful my country is. Didn't get a bacon shark last time, so we are here to get the bacon shark this time. So we are much earlier, still late, but much earlier than before. I'll show you. the beach and the tide is very high very very high yeah we are at plants all around the beach <sighs> yeah. hey y'all today is uh, today is uh, today is Wednesday today is Wednesday guys the 25th Wednesday, the 25th of January. I am not an AC girl. Y'all, my AC does be on and off, on and off, on and off, on and off. Oh, I'm shining here. This is vapor up. Vix. <laughs> I just have to take down this Christmas tree, but I do not want to take it down just yet. Someone mentioned in the comments that they love my hair. It looks good on me. They didn't say they love it. Someone mentioned in the comments that my hair looks, this hair looks good on me. Thank you so much. I find it looks good on me also. I didn't like it the first time I tried it on when I went to Bego but now i know what to do with it to keep the curls and things so i really really like it um yeah so and right now it's still just resting here girl because i'm not going anywhere long enough to keep it stick down okay it's 
it's just resting right here like this is the old enough wig right now but when i am going out out i will do the whole process so um let me i hope you all can hear me you know because God bless everybody in this party. I really like that song. Watch over us. Yes, I really like that song. Bless everybody in this party. Something, something. It was sung by Patrice Roberts. She is literally an artist, a soca artist. Really nice. She has some classics. Okay, so it is Wednesday and I am hungry. Um, I'm trying this thing where I'm trying to save my money, y'all. I'm trying not to spend any money. But girl, every day I get up, I feel like I need something. Don't be like me. This is this is this is me being spoiled. Okay, I feel like I I always have to get something. It could be anything. I just have the urge to buy. I think I mentioned this to y'all sometime already. And I'm trying to save my money. I'm trying to... This year I want to accomplish some things that, you know, I want to... We'll get there. We'll talk about that in time to come. You know, but let me see how best I can do it. But, so the huge amount of things that, I, I, that I'm accustomed to spending my money on and so on, I'm not going to do that this year. I'm going to, you know, I like to divide my year into quarters. So January to April is a portion and then from... You know keep keep it in portions that is an excellent way to achieve your goals also do not try to do your goals for the entire year because sometimes it just stresses you out unless it's something long term you're working on or something like that but you do your thing in bite sizes girl like january to april that portion there put out some of the goals that you want you want to save this amount by the end of april and just chop it up into four pieces okay well i need to save so much in january so much in february so much in march and just Continue to do like that. You want to lose some weight. You want to gain weight. You know, check your weight. Check what you are currently weighing. And then you can check, like, you know, at the end of the month, like, how much you put on, how much you took off, like that. Don't stress yourself out, okay? Because take it from me. I love to stress myself out. And it just doesn't work it because life keeps going on. Anywho, I am sure you like this because y'all, this is vapor up. Well, I've mentioned that earlier. I am rubbing myself down with Vicks because I am desperate to get this cough off. Desperate. At this point in time, I do not care. You and I can tell me try something. I'm going to try it. <laughs> so I talk. Oh, I should have recorded that and show you all. Ooh. Everything is content with me. I took some bush medicine for the first time in my life and it is gross. You hear? Listen, so someone told me about chandelier bush for this cough because this cough is lingering way too long. It's horrible. It's not as bad as before, but <clears throat> when I get a good cough, I get a good cough. So someone told me about chandelier bush and um, girl, I have no idea about those things. I have to talk to my grandmother about those things. I do not know what those things look like, feel like, taste like, but now I do know. So one of my friends, her mom got it for me and she, I went to collect it and it took me a day to try to even think about taking it so i did what they told me to do pound that up and squeeze the juice out of it put it in a shot glass and shot it so i took my second shot just like earlier like about a couple hours ago and y'all oh the first time i took that yesterday <laughs> it was the most nastiest thing i've ever drunk in my life y'all and up to now the roof of my mouth is scratching you know some you know how bush scratches you if you don't clean it properly like if dashing bushy dashing bush and your mouth scratching my mouth is scratching because of that but to be quite honest with y'all i feel as an ants to be quite honest with y'all i feel a little um i feel a little better immediately when i took that shot i felt like this entire green liquid was traveling through my body i was actually feeling your y'all know how alcohol feel when it hits your system that felt like alcohol hit my system or worse but it, it was traveling y'all bitter B <clears throat> girl hopefully this work i am so desperate that i am trying anything for this to work right now so um i did feel like it cleared up something like i am breathing much clearer and 
better and yeah some i don't know what's it something it did something so this was my second shot today i do not have any more um someone was telling me do not take it more than three days so what once tomorrow is out i'm done hopefully this works and yeah so a girl took some push medicine i vex i didn't show all you so right now i'm going to get food because i'm very hungry oh, okay yes okay but i'm starving i'm feeling for shrimp and potato but i don't want to cook it so i'm going to buy food okay don't do like me let's go okay y'all so we got our food i came to canton palace and I purchased listen I would know what I'm going for and I would still take long to get it Ooh. I would know that everything okay you are going for a pork special like pork combination or a chicken I would go there still take the menu still go to the appetizer still do this food that. wasting time not sticking to your budget <laughs> but you know what I wanted something called um, shrimp cocktails or something it looked really good it's like they said cocktails and a shrimp with chef sauce but you know what I just took my roast pork special that was $37 and I'll show you how it looks I'm not like Brittany you'll eat that okay Canton Palace is a very affordable authentic Chinese place for those who do not know I'm feeling for a lot of pepper and soy sauce here, so I kind of like I put a lot of pepper on to the pork so this is the pork and veggies with fried rice mm -mm 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 -mm. i really do not like a lot of ketchup and thing on my stuff but my pork needs to get the pepper okay so yeah so i'm going to go home eat this and um what do we have to do next i have to oh i'm going to record a video you all okay and I have to pass by the girl to get some resumes done for my sister. So it's later in the afternoon and um well it's actually night time so now i'm going to pack out some of my stuff like put some of these things in order you all know the white cupboard i have downstairs that i showed you that i purchased from brand sauce i purchased another one and i'm going to put all my all my self-care products on there so i'm going to have a layer with um lotions only body washes scrubs and so on so it could look all pretty because i want them up here to be very clean and clear i still have all these things to clean from during the christmas you know i still have a lot of i still have this down here um to the bottom here i have a bunch of stuff that needs to get things right <clears throat> So I'm going to purchase some of those storage bins from Brand Source to kind of like put these things in order. I have so many. If you put your hand deep in here, you'll get bites. This is miscellaneous things and I threw away a lot of things here. Alright, I have a bunch of things here like um, balloon pump, confetti. What's this? This is for yeast infection. This is really good for yeast infection. Some of these things I'll have to throw away because... It's expired. You all have another box here. I always have these. Like I always buy these things, y'all, just in case you need them. Or if someone comes by you, look. This one says twenty twenty two. This one says twenty five. So if someone comes by me and they have like an itch or something, 
I got you. I also have like creams, but some of these things need to throw away. If when I had the cough, I have labels. What is this? Can I have a lot of feminine things? Um, I did get rid of some for Christmas, but it seems like I have to get rid of a lot more. Right. I'm afraid to put my hand in this because I'm a bit tight. What is this? This is... I don't know what this is. <laughs> but I definitely need to get those storage boxes from um, Brand Sauce. And I will put them like here right now they have it five five hundred so i'll put one two three four and then it have space in the back so you know i'll have one with probably um what i have here one with hair products another one with feminine things empty bottles i do buy a lot of these from pennywise um these things always have a lot of hair dye all over i don't have a couple of those they're like a whole set what is this this is what's this oh scalp protection hmm, never use that and many more oh i'm pretty honest <sighs> it's a lot hey everybody it's saturday happy saturday <clears throat> and i just finished um filming a video for you guys recorded a video for you guys so that is my plans for today i really don't have anything much on my list today because i'm trying to take it a bit easy today all right but listen every day i would say i'm trying to take it a bit easy but still the sunlight will go down and make me doing i do i need to learn what is a cut off time received a package from fashion over and i want to show you all now this is my birthday my birthday package um, hmm. My top is kind of skimpy, and I didn't know YouTube does come for me and my clothing. They like the people on the workplace, though, it's not a problem. <laughs> um, so, this is my package from Fashion Nova, you know? and this is my birthday package. <sighs> Listen, I went, I waited too long to order a birthday dress. Usually I just order my birthday dress by <clears throat> November, December and I do not know why I took so long y'all I completely forgot that my birthday was right around the corner People like to purchase all the hot birthday dresses for Christmas and for New Year's So I wasn't getting anything in my size and if I do get something in my size, I do not like it But whatever, so I'm going to show you all my birthday dress This is just a by the way dress, it is really pretty though And I think I'll wear this to go to dinner Because I have so many plans for my birthday but I keep searching them but and i'll be going to for one for sure and then i'll keep a party the next day because the plan was to keep a party at home but that's too much at work and then we are doing works on the house so that's too much at work right now so <clears throat> let me show you all the dress i really like it so i'll show you now it's nice you know it, it it's just probably a bit too it what my mom like to say because it's too covered here like it <laughs> my mother loves to say that because it's covered here like it. But this is it with the dress. It's really nice, y'all. It's gonna look nice. Um, I got it in a small. The person was saying that um, <clears throat> it's small fitting, and that's no lie. It has a lot of stretch, but it really is a bit snatched for me. Not the top so much, but the skirt especially. So this is the top. It's one of those bat sleeve thing. And then we have the skirt here. I wouldn't like the skirt is really a bit snubbed for me but it's not overall bad because the medium would have definitely been too big but i probably could have gone with the medium the thing about this type of material is when you do not get your correct side it's very hard to take in because of the sequence and all these things so this is my <clears throat> one of my birthday dress i have to purchase another dress for the party and i have to purchase that locally because it don't make sense ordering anything right now girl what else did I get in this package? Um, Fashion Nova has, by the way, this is Fashion Nova. Fashion Nova has a lot of sale on their shoes. I had made this purchase like the first week in January. So I wanted a red shoe because I wanted to do a photo shoot. I'm not sure if I'll do this photo shoot because I don't like how the bikini looking. But yeah, <laughs> um, this is it. 
and I really find that to get to get nice high heels locally it's very hard so this is why I buy my my heels online because it's very chunky and it's comfortable to walk in so I got this really basic red shoe um, <clears throat> I had a different style in my cart but for some reason I was taking too long to order so by the time I went to order size 8 was out I wear size 8 now by the way you're comfortable so when I no longer squeeze and force myself in a 7 or a 7 and a half size 8 it is for me comfortable perfect fit sometimes I do have a little space and so on but I think it. and then I picked up another shoe <clears throat> this one is a big one and I really really like this one um, hopefully it doesn't hurt my feet I love this there was a red in this and it sold because I took too long to order you all know how it goes when you it's time for you to order so look how nice and cute this is this will definitely go with that outfit there and it is not high I am into not high shoe these days because it just fits perfect okay so this is it and then what else did I get <coughs> from fashion over uh, I think I had some little change to make up free shipping or something, so I just picked up one of these um, necklaces. It's ne the necklace looks really nice online, but in person it just looks too big. But I mean, it will come in handy at some point in time, right? Oh, it doesn't look bad on camera. Hmm. So, what it says is honey. What it says here? Home girl. Honey girl, something like that, and these are singles, so I can wear them all together or I can wear them single. And that's it for my fashion as a whole. I also got some things for sleep, baby. Let me show you all really quick before I, I got some really nice tops for sleep, baby. All it's carnival time, and you know, persons want to fit, so I got some nice crisscross tops. This is selling like hot bread, girl. You know, you can wear it open like this, or you can cross it to the front. And I also got some really nice sexy dresses. I'll also insert a picture so y'all can see how it looks. And yeah, I got this in three colors. And that's it so far. I really have to do a little more investing in my business in order to see my profit. Because when you buy small, you see small. All right, but I definitely have to do a little more. <clears throat> so that's it for this vlog. It is Saturday. I'm closing off this vlog. This week's vlog is over and I'll see you guys next week. Bye people.